welcome back to the channel. I'm gonna be calling this segment uh, Tech Review Tuesday because I just, I've just been uh, accumulating a lot of camera gear, a lot of tech, and I think that um, it, it's just proper to kind of do this on a weekly basis because I've, I've just been given the opportunity to. So uh, I, I, I don't know about you guys, but I usually search YouTube um, before I buy something to try to get a review um, and try to get an understanding of what it is that I'm getting because sometimes the description, the pictures and all that stuff is just not enough. So today I'm gonna be reviewing uh, the Joby Gorillapod 3K versus the Joby Gorillapod 5K. And so Joby came out with this new line of 1K, 3K, 5K, um, as well as some other like uh, mobile uh, tripods and, and things like that for vlogging. And uh, so I actually have two now. I'm using right now what, what um, you guys are set up on is the uh, Joby Gorillapod 5K. And then this is the, uh, the 3K. The major difference is the head part of it. So the Joby Gorillapod 5K is just, it's bigger, it's more massive, and also the, the platform that holds the actual camera is, is all like aluminum, it's just, it's just, it's nicer. The 5K is, I think, I wanna say it's like 175 to $180, and I mean, it's a huge tripod. And then this one is between, I got it for 60, but I think it's like between 60 and 80. Um, and so it's almost double. I mean, this one's more than double the price. The 5K is more than double the price of the 3K. However, there are uses to both of them, and that's why I have them both, because the Gorillapod itself can hold a camera, but there's also other uses for it, like holding this thing, which I'll do a review on one of these days. It's called a Loom Cube. It's a, uh, it's, it's a light. So, you know, I'm like right now I'm mounting it on top of the 3K and the 3K can handle it. And it's, I think it's kilograms. I think that's what the K means. So 1K, 3K, 5K, it's also weight, you know, how, how heavy can it carry? And my wife has a, a Nikon D850 and that camera with a 24-70 Nikon lens is, is super heavy and the 5K holds it no problem. This Gorillapod, the 3K, cannot hold that that uh, rig, but it can hold the rig I'm using now, the uh, the Panasonic G7, or it can hold a light. And the cool thing is, you can still swivel, you can still swivel with the 3K, and and you can kind of turn a little bit, you can kind of loosen loosen it and twist it. But as far as like daily vlogging, if you guys are into vlogging, carry your camera around a lot, you know, holding it out like this, the 3K is actually what I use 90% of the time when I have my camera. The cool thing about the 5K though is with its weight distribution, when I hold the camera, like assume this is the front of the camera, the light part, I, it's, it's actually more stable than the lighter Gorillapod. But again, it has its trade-offs because if you're holding the camera for a couple hours, your arm gets tired. My wife is always saying how she doesn't like this one, the 5K, because it's too heavy. And it is really, it's overkill for like daily vlogging. Um, but it does have um, a, lot, a, a lot of features. The legs are a lot stronger. You know, you can hang it up wherever, um, wherever you... The tripods has their own uses and I've found uses for all of, all of my gear. And that's kind of my, my number one um, thing is, get stuff that you'll use not don't get stuff that is just going to sit in your bag or sit in your closet or wherever it is wherever it is you keep your tools because these are just tools so I, I mean i love cameras i love uh technology i love lights i love i love all this stuff that i'm learning about from a, a filmmaking perspective but you know it doesn't matter what you have as long as you use it um that's when you get the most value out of it so i hope you guys enjoyed this one it's uh you know I'll link everything that I have below. I link all of my gear below. I hope you guys uh, enjoy these tech reviews. And next week, I'm gonna test this Loom Cube out because I just got it yesterday, so I can't really do a proper review. But I'm gonna start lighting like a lot of stuff up with this, um, with this thing, and hopefully it makes makes for better videos. And um, I'm gonna be using it for for other a lot of other projects too. Hope you guys enjoy this one. I'll see you in the next Tuesday. What is it called? Tech Review? Tech Review Tuesday? I don't know. We'll see you next time.